See, these ones that lived in the country, they used to, very rarely, they'd be seen in town. Uh, they used to, there was no transport there, very little left. They were way out in the wilds. They would just come in now and again. Uh, get these, uh, you would get them, lots of them close by, would come in, uh, come into barber shops to get a shave. Uh, Jack Hines had one opposite us. I used to go in there and on a Saturday, sweep up sawdust. And they had spittoons for them. They'd be either smoking a pipe or chewing tobacco. And then they'd spit, so, uh, they'd all come in for a shave uh, uh, from the country. You could tell them a mile off, uh, the way they were, the way they used to walk, you know, oh, oh, uh, uh, yes, used to say, are you down for the day, boy? How do you live here? <laughs> uh, 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 uh. And then it was a great thing, people going into Douglas. Uh, uh. See, there was lots, lots of lived here in Peel that never left the island. I don't know that there, and, and she'd never left the island, never been off the island. There was lots like that, and it was just a, it was a great thing to go to Douglas. And you'd never hear them being gone to Port Air or anywhere like that. Uh, that was like going to the moon. <laughs>